Hey everyone! Let's take a quick look at how to install your brand new Lightroom brushes. We're all pretty familiar with how to install presets, but brushes are a little bit different, so we want to make sure that you're aware of how to do that, and I promise you it is very easy and very quick. The first thing you want to do is you want to make sure that you know what folder Lightroom puts those files into. So if you're not familiar with where those files get saved, you want to go up to Lightroom on your top left corner, click into Preferences. You want to make sure that you're in the Presets tab, which should be the second one from the left. Around the middle you'll see it says Location, and there's going to be this box you can click on. Go ahead and click where it says Show Lightroom Presets Folder and it will literally open this folder for you and show you exactly where everything is so you can see what folders you have to go through to get to it. Now in this Lightroom folder, these are all the files that Lightroom will recognize, including your develop presets and your brushes, which Lightroom actually calls local adjustment presets. So here we have in this folder, these are all of the brushes that are currently installed in Lightroom and that it will recognize. So everybody's are going to look a little bit different. These are the ones that happen to be in my Lightroom. So now that we know where this folder is, let's go ahead and minimize that. You don't want to close it out because you want to remember where that folder is. So we can just minimize it. And then we'll close the preferences. We don't need that anymore. And let's close out of Lightroom, quit the application, because we want to make sure that when we reopen it, Lightroom will pick up on that new brush we installed. So let's maximize this folder again. So here is our local adjustment presets folder with all our brushes. And I have here on my desktop a test brush that I created just for the demonstration so that you can see and make sure that it's getting installed and that Lightroom will pick up on it. All you're going to do is literally click and drag it into that folder and it will get added into this folder. Now, the file extension is the same as your develop presets. If you happen to drop a file into this local adjustment presets folder that is a develop preset and not a brush, Lightroom will not recognize that as a brush. So it's like Lightroom just ignores it. Vice versa, if you drop a brush file into the develop presets folder, Lightroom will not recognize it. So you want to make sure that you have your brush files kept somewhere separately from your developed presets so that you don't mix those up. So now we've dropped this into our brush folder within the Lightroom program files. We're going to close this folder out and let's go ahead and open Lightroom once more because we want to make sure that that brush has gotten properly installed. So we'll just give it a second to open back up. Here we have our sample photo. And the brushes apply for either the graduated filter or the adjustment brush. So you can click into either tools. And here you see our test brush right there. It's installed, it's ready to go. Similarly, if I go into the adjustment brush, it's still there. I can select that and I can go ahead and use it. And it's not one I'm going to be using for this one, but it's there. So we've just installed a brand new brush. I hope this has been very helpful for you. And I hope this helps to take advantage of all these great tools that we have at our disposal. Good luck and have a lot of fun.